Welcome to the introduction of the new Insignia Approver features. Let's start with the rearrangement of toolbars and icons. The standard view section is now always available along the top of the screen. The new buttons that we have available are Superimpose Tool, T1 and T2 in all views where previously was only available within the Movie Tool. Roots Tool. We have now integrated CBCT root data or long roots from our library, which can be turned on or off. Movie Tool. The play bar can now be moved and has been made smaller. Patient photos are also available within this tool. The movie can now be saved as a .mov file for playing on Apple devices. Compass Tool. It is now easier to choose the correct axis within the Compass Tool. When selecting an axis, you will note that the other axis disappear. We have also added the ability to change the center of rotation from crown to root when adjusting torque. Groupwise Editing. With Groupwise Editing, there are three tools, two of which are new. The Smile Arc tool is the same as before, but we have also added Anterior Torque and Posterior Expansion. The Anterior Torque tool allows you to adjust the torque of the anterior segment easily rather than having to adjust individual teeth. Posterior Expansion will give you the ability to either expand or upright the posterior segments when expanding, you can switch on the chart so you are able to see the man trough and the amount of expansion. With every change, the case will automatically be reworked. AP Correction is another new tool within the Approver software. With this tool, you can change the AP and vertical correction yourself without having to write a note to the technician. The Jig Button tool will give you the ability to see the proposed jig grouping design for the patient. If you'd like to overrule the current jig grouping, you can write a note to the technician.